So it's not very often you forecast two to five inches of rain like we did on Thursday and Friday. You get a little uneasy, like what if this claim kind of falls apart? That ended up being on the light side. You don't ever forecast four to 10 inches of rain unless you have a tropical storm moving over you, which we did not. We just had a very slow moving storm system that just kept pouring and pouring. Not one severe thunderstorm warning out of this. It was just rain and rain and rain. How about nine inches in South Milwaukee? Uh, a lot of that coming uh, from the flash flooding late last night. Muskego eight and a half. We're seeing at eight. Uh, Brookfield at 6.35. Officially at the airport, 5.56. And my rain gauge in Cedarburg, I thought that was a lot at 4.2. That was nothing compared to so many readings and there could just fill page upon page uh, with these high rain totals and hopefully uh, not too much rain damage to basements and other structures across the area. But you can see those heavy rains now from Wind Point and Racine, most of Waukesha and most of Walworth County. Everyone else, it doesn't look like much, but picked up about two to four inches of rain. It's these areas that were the five, six, seven, eight, nine inches of rain. Uh, sunshine right now uh, after some morning rain, 67 degrees the high since midnight of that five and a half inches of rain. Almost an inch of that has fallen since midnight. Clouds are moving back in. The backside of this storm system is moving in. If you remember on Thursday and Friday, we said it would rain all day Sunday, all day Monday. This storm tracked a little bit further north today, so it tracked right over us. So we were in the center of the storm, kind of like the eye of the hurricane. So we had sunshine and a calm breeze. Now that storm is moving off to the east, and we're getting the backside of the storm. Rain showers moving into Fond du Lac, Sheboygan, parts of Dodge, and Washington County. These are much lighter. These are not the heavy, heavy downpours. We don't want to see another drop of rain after all that we had uh, yesterday and last night. But as this pushes off to the east, we're getting the clouds moving back in and we will get those rain showers overnight tonight. Best chance after 10 o'clock here in Milwaukee up until about five in the morning, you'll wake up to sunshine. The rain will be out of here, but with the cooler temperatures and all this moisture in the air, there will be patchy fog tomorrow morning and pretty much every morning this week. Look at the warmth off to the west. We get back into the 70s tomorrow with a whole lot of sunshine. So the showers tonight, morning fog and then afternoon sun this week and the 80s return as well. And your yard's going to need it. Everyone's will give it a day or two to dry out. But green lawnmowers across the board uh, for the mowing and yard work. Temperatures tonight in the 50s. Watch out for patchy fog. And then for tomorrow afternoon, we are looking for temps to be in the mid 70s. Here's your seven day forecast. Come on, seven day. Oh, went too fast. Seven day forecast showing uh, 75 tomorrow, 78 on Wednesday, and then 80s return Friday and Saturday. No rain.